Good morning, class, and welcome to History 101 with me, Mr. Spitznagel. Today we'll be looking at technologies in the 1970s. The 1970s were an exciting time in American history. They were the forerunners of the information age. The 1970s gave us many of the technologies that are part of our everyday lives, such as video games, the personal computer, and cell phone devices. Video games first began production in the 1950s by a man named Thomas Goldsmith Jr. The first vi commercial video game appeared in 1971 under the title Computer Space. Though the first video game was launched in 1971, it wasn't until 1972 when the first console was created, which was known as Magnavox Odyssey. Video games back then had simple graphics and it could go only as far as 16 bits. Today, we have games such as Halo and Madden, which have incredible graphics. Personal computers were also big during the 1970s. The first business computer was invented in 1968 by Douglas Engelbart. The first personal computer, however, was introduced in 1972 by Wang 2200 and IBM in 1975. Back then, computers were very basic. They were mostly used for storing information and making calculations. Today, however, we have supercomputers that allow us to do almost anything we can think of, from surfing the internet to sending emails across the world. Cell phones are also a technology that became predominant in the 1970s. People began work on cell phones in the 1940s by a man named Martin Cooper. The first real portable phone call was made on April 3, 1973. Later, the first cell phone network was launched by Japan in 1979. In the beginning, cell phones were very large and clunky devices that had very limited service. In today's world, we have smartphones, which get coverage nearly everywhere on the planet, and even have access to the internet. Other notable advancements as technologies during the 1970s were the creation of email. Email was invented in 1971 by Ray Tomlinson. Ray Tomlinson sent out the first email by accident just to see if he could. Also, LCD became dominant in the 1970s. Though research into LCD technology began in 1888 by James Ferguson, it was not until 1972 that it made its first appearance in a digital watch by Liquid Crystal Company. I hope you enjoyed the lecture and hope you have a wonderful day.